And welcome back to Flexible Games, where we are playing Satisfactory. All right, uh, you know we're we're sort of tickling the power. You can see we're we're starting to bump up and down here, and that tells me that we're using so much power that our fuel supply is starting to waver, which means the the generators that we have going are uh, not getting their 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 best right they're not getting the most amount of uh, fuel that they can have and uh, we want to we want to protect against doing that so I want to work towards getting uh, geothermal up which is under the criterium here we have geothermal generators uh, these are basically free power but it's it's kind of a process to get there we need supercomputers believe it or not and I'm gonna I'm gonna research another hard drive just for reasons um, so we're going to need some supercomputers. And we have all of the, the tools that we need to get to that point. So I think supercomputers, uh, it's going to be sort of a mess. It's going gonna, it's gonna to be a mess. Let's, let's just flat out, it's going to be a mess. Um, but it's also a use for plastic. And we kind of need a use for plastic at the moment. Because we are not using any plastic whatsoever. So let me grab some extra plastic here, maybe one more stack. I'm not anticipating needing a whole lot of crafters for supercomputers. Um, it's because we don't have the, the back end production for those uh, to speak of. So let's see what it's gonna take. Um, I think one ingredient is the AI limiters. One is the high speed connectors that we have right there. Uh, and we're probably going to obviously need some computers. So let's see what we're going to need. Uh, yeah, let's just sort of, is there, okay, there is a center line right there. Where, where'd it go? There it is. That's a decent amount of space. Okay, so supercomputers. Um, computers, AI limiters, high-speed connectors, and plastic. But look at the high-speed connector cost. Almost six per minute. And we are only making nine of those per minute. Each one of these is three per minute, and we have three of them. Um, do we have more potential? Uh, we may have more potential computer action going. Not guaranteed, though. Um, one thing we could do since computers are already like right there uh, we could put a splitter right there and just push it on the bus I think that's probably what we're gonna do let's do a splitter like right there and then a conveyor belt pushing those along the bus line okay what is this this is rubber and that one up there is plastic. So let's get that one stretched across. Okay, you. Plastic can come over. And then computers. Let's beef them up a little bit. And we don't need the throughput, I just. Oh, come on, there we go, right there. Okay, so there's computers and there's plastic. Now we need AI limiters, and I honestly have no idea where I set those up. I know I set them up somewhere. Um, ooh, I think they're over here. Yes, indeedly, they are over here. Um, and how many of these are we producing? Um, we are producing, I think, 10 a minute. Yes, looks like 10 a minute. With, I mean, we, we could expand that a little bit. Um, and we need uh, roughly three and three quarters per minute. So two of these, we would have to add on to high speed connectors, at least one more. One more added onto there would, would be enough for this. Plastic, however, I don't think we have enough plastic production. I seriously doubt we have even one version of plastic production for that. Like, our plastic would quickly start to dwindle 
but hopefully we would have enough to keep things going. Um, AI limited, we have enough of those. Computers, 3.75 permitted on those. Now, I think if we look at this, computers 2.8. So we're at 5.6 computers per minute right now. Yeah, 5.6. So uh, yeah, one supercomputer is basically all we're gonna be able to manage right now. So let's go ahead and push that in. Okay, let's uh, give ourselves a little space. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five. Now, can we go one higher on this just to keep everything above, above board? I think we can. Uh, what is this? You are Caterium. So we don't need any of that. So, splitter on computers. Now, also keep in mind, something else is using computers. So we, uh, we may have to bump computers up, which means we'd have to bump uh, the crystal, crystal oscillators, because we are barely making a surplus of these. Uh, looks like computers is actually full right now, which is nice. I forgot what else, something down there uses them. That one right there looks like it uses them. Um, modular motors maybe? No, that's the, that's the high speed wire or the automated wiring. So that must be the, the modular, the adaptive units. Yeah, adaptive units there. I don't think that uses a lot of computers, but we'll we'll find out shortly. Uh, all right, now the other splitter needs to be on plastic, which is the very, very top. Like that. The other two ingredients are going to be the AI limiters and the high-speed connectors, which are gonna come from this direction. So I'm thinking maybe the top two I have a lot of Mark III belt. So the top two can come from this direction. Like so. And then the bottom two are gonna come from this direction. Like so. Okay, now we want, uh, we want the Okay, so that's that one. So one, two, up from there. And there. Which means you go there and you go there. There's plastic and computers. So we want one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four. Okay, so line you up. Line you up. Like that. Okay, two ingredients down. So this is gonna produce roughly two per minute, eh, roughly. Uh, all right, now for these two things. Um, let's get you squared away. One, two, three, four.
Well, let's see. If we go, that's almost perfect. If we do a, a stacker on top of that, that doesn't really line up. It would line up if we did it from down here, though. One, two, right there. That'd be like the perfect height to go right into like that. Okay, so there's high speed connectors. Let's get those in place. One, two, and right in there. So yeah, these are not super high throughput. We don't need super high throughput on these. Okay, high speed limiters are done. Now AI limiters. High speed limiters, high speed connectors. That's what I meant. I meant to say that, right? Uh, all right, so let's get you offset right about here. Because I want to leave some space maybe for an extra one of these if we do finally um, expand production. I'm not sure if that's going to be one, two, three, four. Yeah, this is going to be roughly how much we need here. So if we go bear belt, can we? Uh, there it is. And then we'll one over the top. Because this setup is built so I can expand it without moving any of this stuff. So there's the AI limiters. Yay. Um, how many do we have? We had we had a little bit. We had a little bit stored up. Alright, now. This is sort of the be-all, end-all of all things. And uh, while I'm off exploring the world, oh, let's future-proof it. Let's put a merger in. Like right here. Then let's do the storage. Like so. And of course, these are not going to be super duper fast, so we don't need to get too crazy with them. All right, now we need AI limiters right about here. No, no bump on this one, straight on through. Okay. And our first supercomputer. Now, again, this is like 55 megawatts. We're, we're tickling the edge of our power. Any more power than this, and we would run the risk of um, something bad happening. Like a, a, it would start cascading. Our power would start cascading down, and that would be a bad, bad thing. Um, oh, our first supercomputer. Let's go see it. There it is. Yes. Okay. I don't know. I don't know if there are alternate recipes to this. After all that work that I just put in, getting all these wired up. Would be a shame to have to break it all down again. But to a minute isn't bad. I mean, an hour goes by, you're gonna have 120 of them. It's not. It's not too bad. You don't use them in vast amounts. You do need them for uh, unlocking stuff and things. Now I could go and manually make a bunch of these. Really odd numbers though, like 28 plastic that that would be hard to, to plan for 
Uh, okay, so geysers. I know there are some way to the... Oh, I still don't have the map. What? I thought for sure I had the map unlocked. Hmm. I thought for sure I had that unlocked. Let's go see how our hard drive is doing. It is done. Okay, plastic plating, size of this seismic noblest thing has come up so many times. I might as well just get rid of it. Um quartz. Radar tower, radio signal. So I'm thinking the radar tower is probably yeah, see map. Why is my map coming up? Am I just hitting the wrong key? Uh, map, map, map. I'm guessing open map. Z. Oh, it is. There it is. Yay. I've been playing too much Imperion. I've got so many different games going on in my head. It's hard to keep track. Um, I think there's a set of geysers over here somewhere. Probably, probably right in where this water is. Um, I know there's some up here. I mean, these are ways away. I do have branches of my base sort of going off in all sorts of directions. Um, so that is something that I can do, you know, off camera. Once I, once I get these unlocked... Yeah, once I get these unlocked... Um, or no, the Caterium. These things here. 50 so that's like 25 minutes worth of production right there um, I got most of these done I really don't I mean yeah I could bump some of these out medical inhaler I, I, I choose to use food for most of my healing and, and stuff like that Uh, 50 yeah flower petals I don't have any of that stuff done don't really need a parachute I do have a jetpack now I could punch these out slug scanning get, get rid of these just more stuff and things out of my inventory uh, okay so you can go you and you can go. I'm really short on plate somehow. Okay. Reinforce. Let's go check our reinforced plate and see if that is a net positive. I'm hoping that it is. That we haven't ran this dry over here. Oh, I think it is. There's definitely more in here than there was last time I looked. Okay, that's good news. That means our new manufacturing up top over there is uh, enough to sustain it. Uh, how are... Let's go check. I know not much time has passed, but... I know we need 500 of those modular motor things. This was... Yeah, one computer a minute, that's... I don't know if we're going to break the bank with that. I know it's going to be close. We'll probably have a net loss on computers. But it is what it is. Uh, this was it over here. We needed 500 of these. One, two, three, four, five. There's 250. So we need, you know, another roughly... A little over... Or a little less than half of... Uh, no, we're, we've got a little over a half of what we need. To fire off the next set of goodies. So yeah, it's just it's just time. Oh yeah, and, and, I, and I hooked this up. Granted, it's mostly manual, but, you know, I've got rubber, I've got coal, and this makes filters. 
um, fabric is is automatically done. I've got lots of fabric, but since you know it's just a single player world, um, and it's not you know we don't need a huge throughput of it. I'm not storing these. I don't need a huge backlog of these. So having this going and just grabbing a stack when I when I need to venture out, because um, I've already don't I have. I thought I had the gas mask. Where did the gas mask go? Uh, let's grab the stack of these. I'm going to grab a stack of those. thought for sure I had crafted a gas mask. Like gas mask in here? Da -da 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 -da. Gas mask. I need, what, 100 rubber? Yep. There it is right there, gas mask. Okay, put a little plastic away. I don't need that when I go on adventures. <clears throat> All right. So the trick when going out and finding geothermal is to try to bring power with you and all of the other materials required to build them, which is gonna take supercomputers. So we need more than you know the 50 that we need to unlock that we need we need those plus the the amount to build the things uh, let's put the 15 i have here away there now i don't have a weird odd stack size of of those frames. <clears throat> I think I'm doing pretty good on everything else. I'm not sure what I'm going to need at the end of all things, but uh, and once these once these back up, I could really shut this down. Like this is using a lot of my resources right now. Um, once that fills up, it's it it'll shut that whole line down. Same with these, although these are brutally slow. I could shut these down right now. Um, in fact, you know, I'm going to do just that. I don't need all of these things. These are some high-level stuff. This will save me a lot on power. I don't need any more of these. I've already, I've already distributed the 100 that we needed. Um, now it's just the modular motors. Because we are tickling the edge of power right now, and I don't want to um, tax the system too much before we get before we get another set of power. There, that shuts that down, which is good, because that is using a lot of really advanced things, especially the heavy motor or heavy frames. So having those shut down is going to help tremendously. Because um, I don't think these use heavy frames. No, these do not use heavy frames. Look how slow that is, though. It's so slow. Kind of glad I have two of these, because, man, less than that would be brutal. All right, well, um, we uh, just some waiting. I just have to have some waiting time to do here. Um, so, in, you know, in between, I'll get some uh, hyper tubes and be able to jump up, jump up there from here. Having a little spot on the end of my bus is gonna really, really help. <clears throat> keep me from running all over creation to to get where I need to go uh, right I wish I could see exactly where that is okay basically it's right on the edge of these two
Okay. So let's take this away. Let's see if I can't squeeze out. No, it's not going to work. I can't put one of these here. Oh, I can. But that's... Yeah, let's go. Let's do this from here. That makes more sense, right? Uh, R noodle. Okay. Yay. Okay, another entrance here. And let's just connect you up. And that gives me a nice way of getting up here. Yay. I could have put a, alternatively, I could have put a jump pad over there. But this seemed, this seemed a better option. All right, well, that is going to have to do it for this episode, and I thank you for watching, and I will see you next time.